how would you like to have $50,000 of new orders from people who have never visited your site? The traffic came externally from an influencer. Hi, I'm Norm Farrar, co-founder of Dragonfish Marketing. I have a podcast called Lunch with Norm, and I am on the faculty here at Digital Marketer. So many sellers don't realize that if you do not have a simple video on your product listing, you'll never get external traffic from influencers. Some people think, oh, you know, this is, it's just too much work to do. I'm telling you today in today's technology, you can do it for free. You can go to apps like Canva and just knock it out in a second. You can use some apps uh, from AI that generate uh, images from stills and turn it into an MP4 format. You can upload it. I'm talking for free. So here's the benefit. First of all, when you have a, a video on your listing, you can tell the story. You can do a product video, you can do an open box video, you can do a how-to video or key ingredients. You can put a lot of information there. In fact, depending on your category, you can put three to six videos. That's great. It looks nice, but what about getting that external traffic? Well, here's the catch. In your videos, you're gonna see whatever videos you've put up. So you, you've put it up, you're the seller. Then it's gonna say related videos, and that's gonna be from an influencer. So if an influencer takes your product and does a shoppable video, the algorithm will see if it's relevant and it will place it onto your listing. If I was the influencer, I might be driving traffic to my influencer page and that traffic is going over to you. This is a, a live case study that we did just recently. One, just one of the videos that we did and the algorithm picked up, we had no control of it, went onto the product listing and we sold $58,000 of product that this product would never have had. So keep that in mind. This is key. This is one of the things you, you must do to get optimal sales on your product listing. So join me in the next video and I'm gonna be talking about the power of copy and your title and bullet points.